You guys, welcome back. Thai Blackpink member Lalisa gave an interview where she shared that she enjoys eating meatballs dipped in a special Thai chili sauce that's sold by a famous food stall in her home province of Buriram, Thailand. Since many people have traveled there to try this and the vendors have sold out continuously. This sauce has been quite the buzz lately. Today I'll be showing you my take on this addicting sauce. This sauce is spicy, sweet, savory, and tangy. Let's get started. For the tangy element, we'll need some tamarind liquid. Dissolve the tamarind pulp in some hot water. Let it sit for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, give a bit of a press and stir. Strain it and now you have tamarind liquid. A few shallots. This thinly sliced one to make crispy fried shallots. And this chopped one for roasting. On medium heat, let's fry the thinly sliced shallots in vegetable oil. Stir occasionally. When they have this deep golden color, they're done. On medium heat in a dry pan, let's roast dried guajillo chilies and your favorite dried red chilies. I'm using tinda. Stir them occasionally. When they've deepened in color and become brittle, set them aside. Let's do the same for the garlic cloves and chopped shallots from earlier. Once they've charred and softened up a bit, Let's remove them. Blend all of the chilies and garlic and shallots together. I'll call this the chili mixture so smoky and aromatic. On medium heat, add the chili mixture. A bit of the shallot oil that was made earlier. Shrimp paste for savoriness and umami. Palm sugar for smooth sweetness. In goes the tamarind liquid. Season with fish sauce, MSG, salt, and white pepper for a nice aroma. A simple cornstarch slurry to thicken the chili sauce up.
This will allow the sauce to hug the meatballs better. And here you have it, Namprik Pao Buriram. Buriram style chili sauce. Heat some oil on medium high heat. Test the oil with a bamboo skewer. If it bubbles like this, add the meatballs in. Your local Asian grocery store should carry an assortment of meatballs in the refrigerated section. Check it out! Here I'm using pork meatballs and fish tofu. Fry until it develops a bit of color. Skewer them up like this. Serve with crunchy vegetables like cucumber and cabbage. Coat the skewers with the chili sauce and enjoy! This sauce is tangy, sweet, spicy, savory, and goes so well with the meatballs. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like and share with your friends and family. I'll see you all in the next video. Be safe everyone.